What's in your makeup bag? Or better yet, what should be in your makeup bag? Sheila Weber is here, stylist, esthetician, the uh, eyelash place. So good to see you, my friend. Yeah, you too. Like I didn't just see you a few minutes earlier yes. when you did my makeup. Put her face on. <laughs> <laughs> but we talk a lot about this. Mm -hmm. I make the classic mistake of throwing everything in one makeup bag and then you can never find anything because you're like, Joni, it's a mess. <laughs> and uh, I don't know if you ladies are like me or not, but I do tend to um, sometimes not take time to pack everything in there and maybe I need more than one. Yeah, that, that's I a think good thing, most right? people need at least one or two that they could add together. You know, to put your stuff in, you need to separate it, just like you do at home. In your, I don't think you throw all your, your makeup in one drawer, do you? Well, no, but yeah. that's a good point yeah. because we are so busy, you know, between the gym and the office and work and maybe it's a party yeah. after party. Yeah. You do need more than just the one bag. Yeah, so let, so let's so talk about some different style bags. Well, are these are, I just bought a, uh, three different ones that are easy. If you can find these plastic bags like this. I found these at a, a Hobby Lobby like store mm -hmm. and you can see in them. These are the new bags that you just pop down in your tote. They've got all the little compartments so you can put all your little goodies everywhere. I like these too because if you have a lot of brushes, mm -hmm. these are good be for the brushes because yeah, the bag just... breathes and you want to make sure mm -hmm. that your brushes are open, you know, uh -huh. that they're getting air. You don't want to see all your stuff because you can you put can it see all everything. along the sides. Like and look that. how easy, see, and then what you can do is just throw it in your purse yeah, and you know, no you're ready to go. There. There's no, there's and no then excuses. this one's a good travel one. It has three different compartments. The top one's for brushes, this one's for makeup, and this is for some skincare products. Mm -hmm. So think about where you're going, where you're traveling, and then I like this idea, uh, let's talk a little bit about this, something that you can kind of keep all of your makeup in for that right. quick fix. Right. Um, I found some little tiny travel brushes. So you just want whatever you use. I just brought up a little sampling of a bunch of things. So you want to keep all your little makeup brushes and, and things in here. Maybe your concealer that you I've want to travel have that. with. <laughs> you know, just little things. If you can find the little tiny mini size mascaras. Yeah, the travel size is great. The, the, anything travel size, I love. Um, and make sure too with your brushes, at least when I'm traveling, I try to clean those once a week. And you had a really good tip yeah, for brush cleaning. The best way to clean your makeup brushes is with, um, in a little cup, put some um, dish detergent with some olive oil and swish them around. It cleans them and then it also conditions the brushes. Olive oil and oh. Dawn. Yes. Who knew? Thank you, Sheila. Best. Now you know what to keep in your makeup bag.